Hi all, it's Debbie for Dealer4519 on YouTube. I have a, a rant I want to go on just for a few minutes because I am terribly upset by this. I have always been a big believer in social justice. And I think that this problem we have with the killing of the police officers, the killing of the black kids, the killing of the black people. I think the shootings by the police, I think the shootings at the police, I think all of this is insane. But it got this far because nobody would speak up. And it just crossed my mind this morning that Michael Jordan is now speaking out. Because now he's had enough. Well, he owns... <laughs> He owns a basketball team in North Carolina, and North Carolina just passed the biggest anti-gay, lesbian uh, bill and took away all the rights, and, and he just didn't say anything then. So, as a resident of North Carolina and as a team owner in North Carolina, um, you'd think he would have said something, but he didn't have enough then. He hadn't had enough when Trayvon Martin was shot. He hadn't had enough when the boy was shot in the middle of the street near St. Louis, Missouri. He hadn't had enough with the shootings of the black men while they were sitting on the ground. He hadn't had enough of the shootings of the black guy who was sitting in his car. None of this ever made him have enough. But suddenly now, he's had enough. So what's he going to do? He's going to donate $2 million. $2 million is going to solve this problem? No, $2 million is not going to solve this problem. He seems to think that you can throw money at a problem and that will make it better. He said, he, I'm going to quote him, Michael Jordan said, Although I know these contributions alone are not enough to solve the problem, I hope the resources will help both organizations make a positive difference. Unquote. The organizations that he gave them to, of course, are surprised. They had no idea this money was going to be coming their way. But they're not going to be able to stop bad police officers from shooting people. And they're not going to be able to encourage good police officers to turn the other officers in. This will not stop black-on-black -black crime, white-on-black crime, racism. You know what Michael Jordan could have done? He could have pulled his basketball team out of North Carolina. That's what he could have done. And that's probably what I think he should have done back... I don't know when the anti-gay, lesbian, transgender bill was passed in North Carolina. In other news, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, who is pretty old right now, has always been an advocate, has always um, been a big, a big influence in not just basketball, but in social justice. And he said something to the effect that he was certainly glad that now Michael Jordan was upset and that now Michael Jordan would take stance. But I think we've waited too long. I think there are too many big stars out there that should have said something when Michael Brown, that was the boy's name, was shot in Ferguson, Missouri, outside of St. Louis. I think everybody should have said something. Um, this money, and you know, it's it's not going to help anybody if it's not used to stop hatred and violence. That's going to be counseling and therapy. That's not going to be programs for black youth and white youth and bringing the community together and police officers meeting the people that they serve and protect, all of that is not what's going to help. What's going to help is if everybody who has a voice, whether you're rich and powerful or just like me, says something.
We have to stand up and we have to stand together because now is not the time to let this country go to hell. Well, for that matter, there isn't a time to let this country go to hell. We have to work and work it out together. Now for me, I promise I will not shoot anyone unless they're pointing a gun at me. There. It's a blanket statement. And I will also promise that I will never draw a gun on a police officer, no matter what. There's a blanket statement for me. But I would love to be involved with an organization who could actually help these communities and these families of the victims. Because there are victims, these, these people who get shot for no reason are victims of violence. We have to put a stop to that. So, I'm asking all of you to please help me and help this country by standing up for social justice and standing up for what is right. If you see something, say something. And I'm not talking about bombs. I'm talking about bad people, shootings, uh, police officers roughing up women. If you see it, either video record it or say something to the media. We have to get our message out there. Let's get this message going. We don't need Michael Jordan, and we didn't need Michael Jordan the money. But what we do need is each other to change this. I hope all of you have a wonderful day. Bye for now.